That man is in far over his head. We're gonna have to cover for him on defense, coach. On 44 stack, 50 monster, pin 40. Just can't allow those other teams to score. No, we can't. But I'm not exactly talking about football. Bill, um, Arlene's outside. He's waiting to pick up Cheryl. Don't keep your mother waiting. You want to talk to me, coach? I know you had that riot in town. That boy who was killed at the store, he was an acquaintance of yours? He was a friend. I still don't condone civil disobedience. If I was head coach, you probably would not be on this team. But I like your hustle on that field, where you attack the ball, finish the play. You're a worker. I'm going to pencil you in as starting strong side defensive end. Julius, I know friends don't come easy. I've got a tiger by the tail that's plain to see. It's cool, right? I want it's like rocking, right? Yeah, it's cool. What? Nobody from my family ever went to no college. I'll tutor you, Louie. I'm white you. trash. I, I, I ain't gonna get no C plus grades. I'm just down home, no good, never going to no college. White trash, man. Take the black boys, ship them off to Nam, and waste them there. Hell, ain't even real war going on down there. Man. The hell there ain't. My brother was. Dimensionally, you know, you plan on putting this in your report. Let's see. What's your daddy's name? I mean, you do have a daddy, right? Look, I have a father, and his name is Eric. And what's he do? Oh, wait, he does have a job, right? Huh? Yes. This one. I mean, I don't even have to ask, but I will. What do you think of this one? Does the term cruel and unusual punishment mean anything to you? Still working. Yeah, nobody out prepares me, Doc. You know that. Oh, yeah. They hate me yet? Yet. Those that didn't hate you the minute they saw you hated you the minute you started talking. Yeah, they've been hating you since you walked onto that field. Yeah. They hate you yet. Wouldn't hurt you to smile once in a while, Herman. Smile? Yeah, smile. Hmm. You think I can't smile? Mm -mm. Oh, Herman, that's horrible. <laughs> that's just horrible. <laughs> Never mind. Cheryl told me about what happened, about your job and all. I mean, everything that they might not have put in the papers. I'm sorry. Life's full of surprises, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Thanks for letting me have her this week. Oh. I know that you didn't have to, and... No, I just want to thank you, that's all. You're still her mother. Nothing that's happened between us is going to change that. Mike and I are heading up north for, um, for a while. Oh, yeah, Cheryl told me. Well, she's all yours. But then again, she always was.
You know, son, I don't care how many games y'all win, them boys ain't never coming in here. You see that guy back there? Dude with the gray hair and the jacket? That's my old man. Well, I don't give a popcorn fart if he's Richard Q. Nixon. I bet you don't. But Colonel Bass just put a call into his buddies at the Justice Department. That's kind of a favor to me for winning the game and all. See, they pretty much agreed to make an example of you. Slap so many civil rights violations on you, it'll make your head spin. Well, you can fight it, too. Or you can be reasonable. Luann, if they can find a table, they can sit in it. Great game, Titans. Great game. Keep it up. Oh, Alex, go on. Thank you. 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 Thank you